Alam Salam Wangwam Kalo K E I E was happening, friend. Benivide to all, sending peace, love, and bliss to all. My friends in the world, if you haven't figured out how to obtain genuine, divine peace, love, and bliss, you are on the right channel, me cariños, because today. I'm going to share with you how to become the creator of your life and stop being the crab at the mother freaking bottom of the barrel. Bless. I hope you all do not mind that this is pre-recorded, but my ancestors directed me to say this a specific way each and every video for the time being. So right now, there's no way I can remember exactly what to say. So that's why this is pre-recorded. I know it's different when it comes to those who um, other tarot, ta tarot channels you watch. But as I said, welcome Beniva Day. And if you are already my friend, you've subbed, then you already know what it is and have already started building, creating, growing, and maturing your peace within self along with genuine love and bliss so welcome black black is for expansion sada cell salute baby come on and sit down at this table so we can pull the newbies up with us so we can all be blessed right right because it's enough for everybody bless so go ahead my a1s from day ones and skip ahead to the astrology t because you've already been through this intro as always time stamps are in the description area and thank you for choosing me to be your connect to the cosmos and using me as your ear because you know i'm nosy so i can keep you up to date on how to move in these energetic and physical streets bless now for those of you who are new don't skip this intro just yet i like to get to know you and you to get to know me before we break bread because everybody isn't going to be ready to sit at the table with us that's just facts no offense <laughs> but i just wanted to talk to you all for a, oh, a minute so first and foremost i'm a real in these social media streets the rare black unicorn some people call me a walking talking breathing tower card blessed i love it and accept that because that just confirms i am aligned with my purpose and i'm helping you get to yours by having a clear understanding of just how life well not just how life but you know um how life and is and life is individually and the life that surrounds you aka energy i created my channel to help those who like me at one point in time have found myself feeling overwhelmed unfulfilled lost in denial and neglecting myself in so many ways um, I was stressed out, I was angry, I was depressed, you name it, I felt it, and I lived it. And I couldn't understand because on the outside, I had it going on. I have five beautiful and handsome kids and all, no disrespect to anyone, but they're with one person and we were together physically for 14 years i have two college degrees i've had decent to great jobs i've started a few businesses myself majority of them failed but hey that's life i tried you live you learn so you can do better right right so on the outside i look great a great mom which i am despite everything else i've never neglected my kids in any type of way they are top priority period but you know i have i'm a great mom um been in a long loving long time relationship college educated a hard worker a go-getter a reliable and trusting friend you know that's who i was on the outside that's what a lot of people saw on the inside, I was dealing with manic depression, anxiety, type 2 bipolarism. I was a functioning alcoholic. Why? Because I was a people pleaser, though I didn't realize it at that time. 
I overexerted myself. Why? Because there was a certain lifestyle I wanted to live and have that I never could 100% reach no matter how hard I tried. I lacked somewhere in some way in my life and definitely within myself. And I was in, actually in a toxic relationship. No disrespect to my children's father at all. And I emphasize no disrespect because one, I've always felt that if you disrespect him or allow anyone else to, to then you're disrespecting me and our kids and vice versa. And that goes for anybody who's in a relationship and they're not fully happy. If you're letting that somebody disrespect your other half, your person, regardless if that's your girlfriend, boyfriend, husband, wife, at the end of the day, if you're with somebody, that person is a reflection of you. So therefore, they're disrespecting you too because you're still with that person, period. And that's just straight facts. Um, but like I said, at the end of the day, that no disrespect, period, and bless. But I'm sharing a little part of myself with you because at this point of my life journey, aka my spiritual journey, aka my life experiences, I've come to realize that one, everything is connected. Everyone is connected as you already know and or heard. And second, that you, me, we are energy because we have a spirit. Our soul is energy and it's connected to frequencies and vibrations, which are our emotions and thoughts. You know, they're the transmitters. Us as individuals are transmitters. We transmit energy and we communicate with other energies and frequencies all the time. And finally, third, my main reason for starting my channel is there are so many people who like me at one point in time was too going to counseling, listening to motivational speakers, part of some type of religion and or community, seeking some type of comfort and familiarity with others to find peace, happiness and resolutions. That's what we do as human beings because that's part of our soul contracts. <coughs> Excuse me. But there are so many people and organizations out here that are very knowledgeable, you know, um, but I never found that balance. I never found 100% peace and happiness until I started looking into astrology and spirituality, aka learning about myself, my energy, my frequency, my vibe, and then studying and following the stars like our ancestors. And thinking about how our forefathers and mothers had used astrology to learn, grow, mature, and overall win in life because the planets and stars go through phases and cycles, which brings me to the terms, there's nothing new under the sun, history repeats itself, nothing changes but time, and it still repeats itself or did I just make that up? I don't know. That last part, I'm not too sure. But I know I heard it somewhere. <laughs> it might have just been in my head. But anyways, my whole point, friend, is that there are so many people like me at one point who are looking for answers, who are striving for something better in their lives. It could be a relationship. It could be your finances. It could be your career. It could just be you trying to figure out you and be a better you. But at the end of the day, we're all looking at other people for guidance and setting other people's lives that are considered quote unquote successful as goals and examples. When we all have specific purposes for our lives. You know, we are all here as the same goes, which is true for a purpose that is unique to self and self alone. Why? Because we signed up when we were at our energetic phase or level, you know, at our soul, just energy to have certain experiences, which is why you were incarnated, a.k.a. born. There is something you are supposed to be learning and listening. That's why everything you experience happens. It's not just a coincidence. This was all planned out. But as I was saying, um, 
a lot of us do not know our own energy our frequency our own vibration and we continue to attract obstacles and stagnation into our lives and continue to look at others who we deemed as living their best life based on what they post on social media or whatnot you know which we truly don't know if they are or aren't you know but um or or you can have people in your personal life that look like they have it all together like me um for example in some type of way on the outside but on the inside they don't and they're struggling or you could be that person so that's a little part of me who i am and my purpose for starting my channel and this community to help others like me who do not want to spend another second another minute another day another month and damn sure not another year trying to figure out how to start seeing positive progress consistently within themselves and their life and whatever area in your life that you want to see positivity and betterment in how by giving you daily updates on how ja god most high universe creator source whatever you resonate with but how Jah speaks to our energy through the stars and planets. That's why we have astrological birth charts for guidance. And that's our starting point on our own personal life journeys that we signed up for. Like I said, when we were just at our energetic self. You know, that is our starting point to let us know, okay, this is what you are going to experience that's why we have birthdays aka stolen returns so that way you know what's coming up what was planned for you you know uh, for that year so that way you know how to navigate so if you never gotten a birth chart your birth chart reading go get one but overall friend i want to help you navigate through life more fluidly and with more purpose and you know just not trying to do things and it's like okay will this work out or even if it works out all of a sudden when it goes left you're lost and you have a hard time bouncing back all by giving you general updates on what phases and cycles the planets are in what energy um is being sent to us aka messages from job and relay more detailed instructions through tarot and channel messages so you can start tapping into your own power and purpose as well and most importantly start using and strengthening your intuition and discernment so you can move wiser and see more positive progress in these energetic streets because you'll learn how to increase your energy your vibration and start vibing on higher frequencies leading you to more positive progress in your life financially personally and in your relationships bless so if you're ready to work put the work in friend to start taking baby steps and then soaring in life as the divine being you truly are take my hand friend come sit at the table and become more knowledgeable on your energy and the energies that surround you and how you are affected welcome to your first sip of the weekly energetic effect welcome to your first sip of the daily energetic detox tea catch these vibes friend ride it out flow and get in harmony bless and once again, thank you for allowing me to be your connect to the cosmos and your energy. Now take my hand, friend, so I can help you take your first step out of that deep, dark, and overly Welcome crowded mommy and poppy chulos yes. and chulas to your daily energetic and or weekly energetic effect tea where i give you a general overview of today's inner planets and luminaries or for the week what zodiac signs they're in so you know how your energy aka your emotions actions thought processes thoughts etc is being affected for the week and for the day as well as break down what each year 
month week moon cycle and day represent energetically so you'll know what to focus on so you can be more informed on if you are flowing with energy or if you are creating blockages in this cycle of your life to learn which frequency you're on and familiarize yourself with the vibes you're sending out to universe and what universe is sending you because this universe the world and even us move in energetic and physical cycles levels and phases whether you're aware or not i'm here to help you get on the correct frequency to heal have success in all aspects and maintain that success by learning your spirit your purpose and to activate you you can use my videos as footnotes a cheat sheet or whatnot to have a better understanding of any situation you're in that is or isn't flowing the way you want it to because i keep my ear in these energetic streets for you and for myself <laughs> but like i was saying you can take some of the tea i spill and use it as footnotes or whatnot with other general tarot readings as well to have a better understanding of why you're pulled to that reading to confirm you truly are in alignment with success what it is about you your energy that you have people trying to hate on you you know the type of uh tarot readings you people watch i watch them too <laughs> but like i said it's so you'll have a better understanding like especially for the ones where it's well why is um someone hating on you are you attracting that because there's something within you that the situation is trying to show you about yourself or are you truly operating as the best person you can be in alignment with your higher self and it truly is what it is you know they're just hating it comes with the territory but whatever type of general tarot reading you mix my tea with whatever situation or experience you're having you'll have a better understanding of why you're experiencing what you're experiencing and why people are either reacting or responding to you and you as well to them and life in general because people gonna do what they gonna do either way the situation and or person is either a lesson to address nurture and heal something within yourself so you can stop taking that repeat test because it'll only get trickier and harder every time you go through the same slash similar person and or situation or my astrology and tarot readings will help you confirm you are on the right path you know either way just think of me your friend a real as being your voice of reason to help you see life in black and white because it truly is but overall mommy and poppy chulos my videos are to help you become one with self to truly operate as the divine being the divine creation Jah made you to be because we all want to live the good life right right passionate relationships bank accounts with two to three z commas minimum but most importantly we want stability security happiness peace and self-love right right because when you're at peace everything is all good overall we're living a sensual lifestyle you know i don't know about you but i am creating my life experience to feel like a daily vacation bless now let's get into this astrological update afterwards you'll have a three pile chakra pick a card option i have been guided to do a root chakra heart chakra and crown chakra readings and we'll talk more about that later but for right now friend catch these vibes ride it out flow and get in harmony friend and i'll see you in the astrological report for the day and or week bless hey friend 
Welcome to your Friday, January 7th, Daily Energetic Detox Tea. What y'all sipping on? Of course, I'm sipping on something to help stay clean, balanced, and uplifted. Bless. As I say on my other channel, go grab your notebook, something to write with, a snack, breakfast maybe, depending on when you're watching this, and something to drink, friend. And let's catch these vibes, flow, write it out, and harmonize. Bless. So, as always, your girl has put her ear in these energetic streets ear hustling like always and guess what y'all the streets are dead today there is no new action today bless with all these current and upcoming retrogrades semi square offs full blown square offs pisces energy running through all of our lives so strong so strong I'm going to be honest, I don't know if I like Pisces energy or not, because it can be very tricky energy. You have to stay 10 steps ahead working with this energy because it rides the fence on if it wants to help you aim high or aim low. And that's just my personal opinion, because at the end of the day, all 12 Zodiac constellations can do that. But for me... I say this because I have Pisces in my Mars and Venus and a few other areas in my birth chart. So it's personal. But like the saying goes, when you know better, you do better. Facts, right? Right, friend. Anyways, I almost missed it and forgot there actually is one transition today. The moon is going to go void from 5.23 p.m. Eastern Standard Time through 12 26 a.m the next day friday jan i mean not friday saturday excuse me saturday so as always just a friendly reminder to take this time to do some personal inner work treat yourself love on yourself friend uplift yourself not waiting for somebody else to do it uplift yourself and ground yourself so that you can continue to soar overcome challenges overcome blockages either self-created or was sent your way that are for that are your tests remember these are our tests our life journey tests that we signed up for when we were just in our energetic bodies but anyways that's all for today happy happy friday y'all this was quick and easy oh just a little side note i just remembered so each day of the week has an energetic purpose aka spiritual purpose aka magical purpose i love it y'all i love having purpose anyways venus is ruled i mean excuse me venus rules fridays oh, yo i don't know about you but that freaking excites me because you know venus is all about looking good feeling good and so forth and it's friday and everything and then with there being no transits to report except for the upcoming void moon why freaking not why freaking not right so let's just take a mental emotional and spiritual break from all this ascending that we have been doing working on ourselves um busting down blockages getting over our own little shadows and stuff and i say little lightly you know just to lighten the mood you know because these sh shadow work is heavy <laughs> you know but today friday also means hanging out with family and just and having you know intimate fun times with other people so hang out with yourself today hang out with family and friends with good ass energy and stay blessed up y'all stay blessed up friend remember you are the creator and co-creator of your life don't ish move until you say so and remember be kind be patient and be easy on yourself treat yourself well and speak life into yourself and you'll make the transitions to leveling up much easier bless like i said that's all i have for you Thank you, friend, for vibing with me. Thank you for letting me be your connect to the cosmos and ear to these energetic streets. And thank you for joining me on this journey. You know, with me, friend, um, when I level up, all my people leveling up with me, those who are ready, I should say, blessed. I hope, like me, 
you were able to catch the vibes you can ride the day out flow and get in harmony in order to grow and prosper today thank you all for um joining me since you're still here friend please make sure you hit my thumbs up button so i can reach more like-minded people and don't forget to hit my friend button aka subscribe button to make sure you and make sure you select the all option so that when i call to spill more tea you won't miss my call honey also friend for every physical action there is always a coinciding spiritual action how you speak and treat yourself affects your energy and is reflected in your physical life change your mindset and you'll change your life keep vibing high friend continue to be irrefutable and i'll see you in the astral plane or the next video